Well, actually, looking back, this was a big issue at one of the very first IGFs in 2008 in Hyderabad. The people say connecting the next billion is not really the issue because that happens. But connecting the last billion will be the challenge. How do you bring the people online who live in maybe very remote areas? But there's also the social issue of people who don't want to go online. That's a kind of refuse next. But as we move to a more and more digital-based knowledge society where actually government services rely on the internet, uh, their not going online is also not an option from a government perspective because the government needs the internet to reach out to the people and also we have challenges with aging populations where the internet can be a great help for healthcare for instance. So where everybody actually ought to be online. So the challenge really will be to bring the last billion online where we really have a knowledge society where everybody can benefit from the internet. But uh, there are obviously technical access issues but also the social issues to create confidence among those who don't want to go on the internet to give incentives to those. This is obviously the privilege of rich societies which have a very small percentage but there may be people who don't want to and there is a governments need to be persuasion and in developing countries the challenges are totally different. They're, they are <coughs> technological, they are financial but a lot of progress has been made. There are also ways of community services and as far as I understand it there's a big experiment on the foot at this IGF with satellite, low-flying satellite-based technology that facilitates access in the equatorial areas, which would be a great boost also to developing countries to get access onto the internet.